Okay, okay, sir. So, what should be done post MD, sir? For this. See, after post MD, you have uh, mostly many of the students go for the SR ship. In SR ship, what happens that if you are taking, if you are doing the one year of experience in SR ship in any certain institute or in, or in any state government colleges, then you are eligible for an AP. But if you want to become an AP in a, in a certain institute, then you need to have a three years of experience. After SR ship is maximum of three years. You should go for SRC for three years because th after three years you will be you will be getting a, a, a opportunity like anything from anything to anywhere you will be getting an opportunity because wherever the vacancy comes out it will demand three years of experience post MD. So yes, you should go for SRC. But yes, the second factor is that many of us also get an uh, offer from the private sector, from the corporate sector. I myself have got several offers from the private sector, corporate sectors. Uh, in last one month after my result and after my tenure completed. So there are much offers, but yes, at that time, if you join a private sector or, or a corporate sector, at that time, uh, you will be having a post of the uh, regarding, uh, means no, it won't be counted as an SR. It won't be counted as an experience. You are, you are just doing a job over there like a junior consultant. So that won't be counted whenever you will join for, a, uh, for an AP. For an AP, there should be like three years of experience in central and one year in state. So many of us have joined after one after doing one year of SR ship in central or in state, they joined as an AP. Many of my seniors have are doing three years of SR ship and then they are having a plan of joining in central institute only. Okay, sir. so if, uh, that's the scope. And then what is the scope for job after post MD? See, post MD means if you have a three years of experience you can go for an ap see it depends if you want to go for a private sector then there will be no academics there will be no pg teaching schedule you will be just doing the job over there and and just coming back but yes if you want to go for a academic life a conference life a um, uh, regarding the pg uh, uh, the education teaching education and all then yes after the post md three years of experience of as an sr you can join as an ap in in any colleges be it in central be it in state you can join so there are many vacancies which are out which comes out after three months after three months four months every year uh, so that you can apply at that time if you want to apply for an uh, ap ship in any central government or state government but Private sector option is, is always open because if you're having a three years of experience, then it needs, then anyone, um, uh, there is a high chance that anyone can take you in any sectors. Okay. Okay. So 